Hello and welcome to Purple Fox Gaming. Today I'm doing a second Mine Lab video. Um, I've made it on Super Flat World. I probably should have done that for the other video because it's not easy to work with. And um, let's get started. So it's based on the um, redstone I did in the last episode, but this time it's in a slight different concept. It's more of a defense system for if you get unauthorized access in your building or something. Uh, so I'm not actually going to incorporate it into a building, I'm just going to set up a little model of it. So you want to have a door here, and just put two bits of wood there. And then the other side of it, we want to have a pressure plate, it can be stone or wood, it doesn't actually matter. And you want to have redstone repeater on the fullest delay. And then we want to put a little T-junction of redstone there. And we want to put another two redstone repeaters on each side. Hopefully I'll get them around the right way. And then over here we want to have another T-junction where the dispenser is facing towards the door. So I'll just fill this up with 64 arrows. And um, let's check if this works. Basically what should ha happen is that normally you would walk in, walk straight over that pressure pad and the arrow should shoot at you and obviously as this is visible um, you probably know that there's some sort of trap here but you can make it underground it's pretty easy but just for speed I wanted to make it above ground so if I just walk in you can see it started firing and it's going to kill me if I'm probably on survival mode and um, you may be thinking oh but what happens if the person coming in is fine and they're okay well I'll show you what you can do then um, basically to stop this you've got to break the circuit so just wait for the pulse to finish that's the wrong way so I'll just put that there and basically if you're authorized you'll know what to do in this situation so you'll walk in um, and you'll basically stay sat on the pressure pad uh, it will fire one uh, but that's not going to kill you, but then you have to keep on standing on it and it basically disables the dispenser. And that's, that's what's quite good about it, but unfortunately there is one flaw with this. And that is the fact that to reset it you do have to break the circuit and put it back in. And also if it's above ground this is really easy, uh, but if you're incorporating it into a building then you'll have to probably dig up the floor and reset it. Uh, but it's I suppose it's just like an alarm you reset it and all of that um, but it can be quite annoying I suppose but I'm sure some of you clever people out there who know a lot more about wrestling than I do will be able to come up with a solution to this uh, so thanks for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this video remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed watching and I hope to see you next time